Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we're gonna show you guys how to download and install Office 2024 on Mac. Office 2024 is newly released and is now available with Indigo Software. Because of that, we're releasing some new videos covering updated tutorials on how to install and use these versions of Office. Before we jump into that, if you're interested in purchasing Office 2024, Windows 10, Windows 11, remote desktop licenses, or a wide variety of other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software, we'll put links down below. So without further ado, let's jump in. All right guys, so we are here on my Mac laptop here. This is my MacBook Pro. And I'm simply gonna go to setup.office.com on your preferred, on my Safari browser. Any browser for this will be fine. I'm gonna click sign in. This is an important step. We wanna make sure that we sign into the exact Microsoft account that we want this product to be permanently registered to. In the case of reinstalling or using this on a different computer, you will only be able to use this Microsoft account once you activate the key. Once in here, I'm gonna go ahead and paste the key. We're gonna blur this, but you would paste your product key in here as well. If you do not already have a product key, again, you can check the description to purchase from Indigo Software, or if you purchase from a different vendor or from Microsoft, in most cases, your key will be available in your email. So just go ahead and find that, copy it, and then let's jump back to the video. All right, once we're in here, we're gonna click next. Okay, and then all we have to do at this point is hit redeem. Okay, and once we do that, we should be met with something that looks like this. We can navigate down to services and subscriptions now. Okay, and once we're here, simply scroll down a little bit until we see are products that you've purchased. So underneath this section, we're then gonna find the correct copy of Office. A unique feature of Office 2024 is that the license can be either used for Mac or Windows, not both, so you only get it on one computer, but you only need one license, and this eliminates the potential accidental purchase of the wrong license. So that being said, I'm going to go with the most recent one that I just added because I've already registered this one to my Windows PC. So I'll click Install here, and we'll click Install again. It's gonna download our .pkg. So once this is done, we'll be back. All right, the installer has just finished downloading it, so I'm just gonna double click it. I'm gonna press continue and continue and agree, and we'll just click our way through the rest of the wizard, leaving everything as default. Here we'll need our computer password, the same one we used to open it. Installation was successful. Let's go ahead and close this out, and we'll open up Word just to make sure everything is working. We're gonna be prompted to sign in once again to our Microsoft account upon opening an application. We only have to do this once inside of one application. We're gonna select again our desired license that we wanna activate. We'll press continue. And now if I go up to Word and I press about, we can see we have Office Home and Business 2024 installed. All right guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. If you have any questions about activating Office 2024 on your Mac, drop those in the comments below and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Again, if you're interested in purchasing Microsoft Office, Windows 10, Windows 11, remote desktop licenses, or a wide variety of other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software, we'll put those links down below. As our channel grows, we're constantly looking for new and helpful video topic ideas to make. If you have any video ideas of your own, we strongly encourage you to put that in the comments below as most of these requests get made into actual videos. Lastly, a like and subscribe would be greatly appreciated as it helps to support the channel. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you guys next time.